here. This is the main, one of the main roads into the city centre from the, from the north part of the city. And off, off Scotland Road would have been lots and lots of different little streets. And my granny was lived in this street. This is where my nana Croxton lived. Now, obviously, it's very different now because you can see the beginning of the street, but new houses behind it. And if you look right up on the hill, you can see St George's Church up on the hill in Everton. But this this would have been a street running right down to Great Homer Street, and on either side would have been, I think there was just houses, like um, terraced houses on one side, but on this side, my granny lived in what was like a sort of... Like they were like tenements, and she lived on the first land, and she had a balcony. Down below her would have been sort of houses on the street, and then up above her would have been, I think, what they called the attic, attic houses or attic uh, rooms, where like, an old, at that time, whenever I remember it, an old woman lived up there, up mm. a little winding staircase. But this is where we were. We spent a lot of time here because my dad was away at sea. And my mum had us. We Where did you? How far down did your granny live? Right down at the bottom. She was the first. So how far down would that be? Oh, way past where that house is there. Yeah. Kept, kept on going down. It was near enough on Great Homer Street itself. Okay. So this was Q Street. Yeah. And then you didn't have to go very far to the nearest pub, which was the Newsham Arms, which is it's not down now. So we're gonna switch off and then. But here, oh sorry. Here, was there was a there was a telephone box here that I remember, and I think I'm pretty sure that here was a um, was a newsagent shop, a little sweet shop, 